YouTube, what's going on? Today, we're going to be taking a look at body cam shows tough guys trying to fight five police officers roy it out so a little bit of a backstory on this this came out a few months ago i finally found the whole video but the real backstory so this is a veteran right keep this in mind he's going through some mental health issues so keep this in mind while you're watching it it may be a little bit funny but honestly if you look at it deeper it's not so funny uh but he's on a mixture of steroids and some hard drugs such as meth and cocaine or something like that and so i mean it shows a danger of taking steroids in the first place but when you're mixing steroids with other hardcore drugs like this it gets very serious right it's a 25 minute video i kind of know like when this ends when it stops getting good but we're just going to react to this so let's see it you guys right now whoever could go toe to toe with me head to head push up the push up with good let me be quiet and go in my own house that i earned with my blood, my sweat, and my tears. Have a little on it for you. It's 1.30 a.m. in Reno, Nevada, where police are called to an apartment complex for the second time after reports of a man who is yelling. What's he yelling for? Oh, it's open. What's he yelling for? Right. Hey Chris, Reno PD, what's going on, man? I got no guns. Okay. Who are you? I'm with the Reno Police Department. I work with your brother. Get your hand off the weapon right there, mother. I got my hands right here. Right. Take your hat off, you. Chris. You, Chris. <laughs> Chris. You. He's breaking him down. Chris, what is going on, man? Oh, you see, they know who he is, which is sad. Because that means he's had previous issues, stuff like that. Where's my brother? I need a hug, man. Don't shoot me. Where is your brother? I don't know. We've been trying to get a hold of him. Oh. Can I get a hold of my brother? See, I believe that his his brother is a police officer, too, but I'm not sure. So that makes like this whole situation much deeper. Uh, a lot of people who reacted to this didn't exactly like, explain this going into it. My name is Christopher Hedges here. You guys shot me 2020. You guys didn't pay me any money. Chris. You shot me in my right shoulder. Chris. Oh, shoot. Chris, what is going on? Jesus. Dude, he is jacked. <laughs> What's going on today? The, get, the guy goes, jeez. Get, get the f*** out of my way. Move away. All of you. All of you move the f*** away. Back the f*** up. And if you do the shit in the back, shoot me the f*** you got to take me? Chris. I'm in my own apartment. Chris. Chris. Stop it. you got a bunch of your hey, neighbors you are calling. You guys trying to take me to jail? Police identify the man seen here as 45-year-old Christopher Sheehan, the brother of an officer and military veteran. Uh, so he's the brother of an officer and he's a military veteran. Right, so he's dealing with like some PTSD or something like that, and it's giving him problems. Let's keep that in mind as we watch this. Try to stay respectful. I'm gonna walk to the hospital with my dog now. Get the f out of here. Chris. All of you now. Chris, what is going on today, man? If I ask you guys nicely, I'm gonna tell you guys. Dude, right he's now. jacked go though. He is me. huge. Head to head, push up the push up with Giddy. Going facing yeah. the west right here. here yoked, facing that. I'm not saying I'm yoked. Okay. Back up and stay. Are you scared? You're scared. You're scared. Are you scared or not? Be honest. I'm not scared of you, dude. There's I, know, I, know, I know you're not scared of me. Okay. I'm scared of me. Okay. I fear one man. And his name is... Do you want to know what his name is? Can I do a push-up? You guys want to shoot me in the back? Chris. You promise me? I'm, I, listen, I'm, I'm a man. Chris, do you remember I'm me? a man, right? I'm a man. Chris, do you remember me? We talked at Sports West. What's your name? It's Goodrich. Goodrich, what's your last name? First name? First name. It's Elliot. Elliot what? Elliot Goodrich. When's your birthday? Well, Chris, it's in February. What's your f***ing number your birthday? Chris, what's going on tonight? I'm doing <laughs> When's Chris, your birthday? My brother's February 14th, 1979. Okay. Yeah, I know your brother. I know him week as well. Dude, shut the f*** up. Chris, what's going Dang, on? Dang, dude, he's cranking those out. Why are we out here tonight? Because I want you to shut the f*** up. Why do you keep yelling? Shut up? your mouth, please. Chris. Put your taser down and shut your mouth. I see your taser right there. I know, because you got me amped up right now, Chris. All your weapons, I see them right here. Chris. I got you amped up because you guys are soft. Every one of you out here is soft. Okay. 
every single one of you, especially that guy. Dude, right look there. at his shoulders. Here, Chris spots another officer standing in the That's distance crazy. and is, let's just say, not too happy about it. He's it taking them down one by one. I see you, dude. I'm not trying to hide. You think you're hard? Chris. You think you're hard, brother? You think you're standing there hard? Stop, my friend. You're gonna shoot me because I'm because hey, you think I think no. I'm better than you. I was there when that happened, my friend. Do you Shut the talk? up. Okay. You weren't there. Yes, I was. Did you come up and hit me in the chest, man? No. You're okay. I tried to. Did you come up and hit me in the abs, man? You're Chris. Good. Can we bro, do his that? arms are Did you say I love you, bro? Did you say that to me? Chris. Did my, was my brother there? Hey, Chris. Can we get you some help, my friend? I already got you. Huh? Officers keep their distance from the 45-year-old as this late-night drama continues. What's up? Chris. 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 You guys think you're f hard? Chris. Navy SEALs are f hard. David Doggins, Jocko Willick, Jocko, run this country. David Doggins, run this country. David Goggins. Kyle Milliken. You guys know who Kyle Milliken is? You know who Marcus Petrelli is? Chris. You guys know who they are? I bet you read their books. You guys think they're f hard? I'm hard. I'm hard as f. Tommy did it. She is, baby. She is. She is. She is. Four, 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 four. Get the f back now. David no Goggins' motivation. Don't stop, boss. Chris, can you stop and listen? We need to get your help. You know you go get help. Don't no, stop. Stop with us. Don't shoot Chris. me here. No, Chris. I Please don't shoot me. I'm going, I'm going to get my own help. Stop. We're going to stop. We need I'm to get your help. See what's happening. Chris. I'm going to get my own stop. help. What's happening is he's got so much testosterone in his body from all these steroids that he's taking that when he takes these drugs and stuff like that, it pushes him over, like, over the edge, right? And that's important to note for someone that is taking steroids, right? If, if for some reason you're taking them, that's important to know. If you start taking other drugs, stuff like this could happen to you. And obviously the drugs that he's taking are much, much further than, like, what most people are thinking but still that that's one of the dangers of steroids right something small could probably even push them over the edge too don't shoot hmm. me in the back hey don't stop. shoot me in the back Rio P. don't arrest me We're don't going. touch me We're gonna get you i have broken no laws shut the f up let me be Chris. quiet let me be quiet and go in my own house that i burned with my blood my sweat Chris. and my tears i understand shut the f up. We're gonna get you some help. Okay? I'm gonna go get some right now. We're gonna get you to. No, no, I'm no. gonna go get. Shut the f up. I'm walking. No. Ah! You need to stop, my friend. I'm here to help you. We're trying to help. Yes, you. Yeah, you tough situation. Me. You guys will not touch Chris. me. You especially. You're all weak. Okay, Chris. Think I'm hard? Think I'm cranked out? Wood. It's not long until officers decide they've seen enough. Can I pray, guys? Chris. Can I uh oh. Pray? No. I can't pray. No. We need to go get you some. Okay, I'm going. Yeah, don't okay. touch me. I'm going to my window. No, we're not going to I'm the going to my apartment. That is Dude, he's, my he's pretty chiseled, but he's got that GH gut. Go. Can't lie. Thank you. We're going to take me to the hospital. 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 We're going to take me to Who's not exactly calming down? So why does it take so many of you guys? Because you're amped because up. You're amped up. No, we're I'm not amped up. Okay, okay, leave me alone, please. We're not here to hurt you, Brad. We want to take you to hospital. You're not, you're not taking me to jail. Pull up my pants. So you pull up my pants. Pull up my pants, mother. Do pull up my pants. Pull up my pants. Pull up my pants right now. Pull up my pants. Dude, so you can see the smallest things making him really mad. Leave me the alone! He must be pushing over 2,000 testosterone minimum. And then with the rest of the stuff that he's on, you can see this as a result. Let me touch my dog if you're going to help me. Let me touch my dog if you're trying to help me. You shot me in my mother. So my I dog's inside my apartment. I, I Let me go in my apartment. Mother. Okay. Let me go in my apartment. Please, I don't have weapons, guys. I don't have anything to hurt anybody. Please leave me the f alone. I haven't broken any laws. Let me go to the VA hospital. Let me call my buddy Doug Donor. 
to come and take me to the VA hospital. I need to go. Leave me the f alone. Please don't come. I didn't break any laws. I'll calm down. I'll take a knee. Can I take a knee? Can I please take a knee, guys? Take a knee. Take a knee. All right, now calm. I'm calm. I'm calm. Can you guys please let me go to the hospital? Man? Okay, we're going there. Okay. Officers lead our suspect to the parking lot. Seems like he's is waiting. Oh, shit, somebody video this. Oh, jeez. Please, somebody video this. Reno, help. Reno PD, you get out of my. Where's my dog? Where's Remy? Where's Remy? Dude, he's got a lot Where's of energy. Remy? He's got to be on a Where's lot. Where's Remy, my dog? Give me my dog. Pull my pants up, you mother. Ah, I'm sorry for calling names. Okay, can you stop? Sorry for calling names. Okay, Chris, we're just trying to get you help, my friend. I just want to get my dog! Get the f out of my apartment, you apartment. That is my place! Agreed. Chris, ambulance right there, my friend. Where's my dog? Where's my dog? It's in the house. Where's my dog? Let me close up my stuff. My out. window's Wait. wide open. You guys win it. You're smoking a cigarette. Let me have my dog. Wait, what? Let me have my dog. Who's smoking a cigarette? What kind of dog you got, my friend? You guys are so weak. Right there. You go. Okay. No, you go. Go. Chris, come on, man. What am I doing wrong? Am I breaking a law? Yes. How? You're being too loud. Would you piss all your neighbors off by screaming? Yeah, sorry. Chris okay, I'm is sorry. actually seated on a stretcher. Bro, look at his traps. Holy crap. So why, when can I go back in? Because I've broken no laws. I've done nothing wrong except for yell. And I will, I will shut the f*** up. And I just ask you guys to leave me alone so I can do push-ups. You guys won't leave me alone. Don't look through my Do I go in your house and look through your Okay. Well, he just I needs will. a ranch out in the middle of nowhere. Hey, everybody, we're going to so get you right yell. back to that body cam in just right. a minute. But before we do, here's... You guys are going to arrest me, aren't you? You're going to throw a charge or a disturbing the peace or something like that. Most yeah. likely, yeah? Tonight. First for tonight. You're going to take me to jail? Mr. Yep, I knew you would. I knew you would. Moments later, one nice officer really cracks this case. Take a look. Can you push what? my elbow back a little bit? Back like this? Yeah, yeah. That, that way, yeah. Keep going. Uh, Say when. Uh, keep going. Uh, yeah, keep going. What? Let's go, dude. Send it full send. I'm not gonna go too hard. I don't want to hurt you, man. Do as hard as you can, bro. I know, but Everything. I don't want to hurt your joints or not. Just, I just, I need it to break. I need it to pop. Doctors or chiropractors, so yeah. we'll let them uh, figure that out. Ah, uh, yeah. Better? Yeah, I really know. <laughs> there you go. Yo, yeah, what? That was the best thing you ever did. It's here our suspect brings out his inner Uncle Rico. Did you fall at all or anything, Chris? Looks like you have a little scrape on your back back here. Yeah. You fell? I fell. I did a, I did a back roll. Oh, okay. Did you, so did you hit your head at all? No, I just did it on purpose because I'm just practicing. I'm going to walk on at UNR okay. for football. All right. Dude, I'm that'd be scary. Yeah, thanks. Hey, I need a f***ing blanket. He'd, he'd fail the drug <laughs> test. So. Did it. Sorry. I cracked the whip, though. He should play football. That'd be crazy. No, I don't need one. I got one right here ready for you. Yeah, I got it right here, man. I don't need it. They call me the White Geronimo. The White Geronimo. What position are you playing football? Running back. 34. I want to go get tattooed right now on my chest. A big heart right on my chest and 34 right underneath it on my ribs. Right next to the fight matters. Or somewhere. I'm just visualizing. What's the 34 stand for, man? He's the best running back ever played football in the history of the NFL. Who's that? Yeah, buddy! <laughs> Chris finally agrees to lay back on that gurney when he soon Should finds get himself on some football. in a That'd probably help him calm situation. Down. Oh, I'll pull up on my right arm. You're real strong. Yeah, pull up. Come on, Mr. Strong guy. Have a good day. We'll get you down there with some help. Okay? Have a good day. Get some help. Go from there. Right. You want to just keep your legs up here for me, my man? There you go. Okay, I got ah! it. Ah! What is he doing? Can you guys please get the cuffs off now? They're hurting my shoulder, bro. Can you put them in the front? Can you put them in the front? What's that? I can put them back behind you, but I can't put them in the front. Uh, sounds like... How does that happen? Take me to jail like this. You guys take me. Take me to the hospital. I'll go to the hospital, I guess. 
Can I please have you the cuffs off? Or re can you guys redo the cuffs? Stand me up and then redo the cuffs so it'd be comfortable at least. You can put them back behind you. Okay, cool. You gonna be all right with me, Chris? Absolutely, bro. Swing off to the side over this way. Officers adjust those handcuffs and prepare to take Chris to the hospital. Okay, here's your phone right here in between your legs. Put it right on my. Put my phone on my big old. Please. What? Right. Holy crap. Can we put on the song on my phone? It's called Geronimo. <laughs> I don't know if that's the time for that. Don't touch my phone. This thing's wrong, right? I don't know. But it's awesome. It'll get you going, guys. It'll get you woken up in the morning. And it'll also warm you up when it's nice and toasty warm in the cool. Whoa! Whoa! Top of the morning to you. I'm never talking again. It's the last time I talk. But as you might have guessed, that's not the last time from Chris. <laughs> of course Somebody I did. Please pour a cold cup of water okay. right on my nuts. The only thing I need to do here is for make sure it's locked Just up. Wait. As Chris heads for the hospital, <laughs> officers Ooh. check in with a few of his neighbors. Let's see what they have to say. Does he have history of just not being stable yeah so he's he's a veteran i don't know what mm -hmm. service he was in yeah so he's a veteran and, like. and, uh, he suffered some sort of a brain injury yeah uh, oh i didn't know about the brain injury with, you know, with steroids doesn't really help anything yeah. so you know seeing as it was just veterans day yeah I don't yeah. know if that triggered him. That's what we were oh. just talking about. I'm, yeah. I'm so, sure. It's like, that's super sad, right? You hear it was just Veterans Day. Probably triggered him, right? So he's he's a military veteran with probably some sort of PTSD. Uh, you see he's he's on steroids. He's on some hard drugs. I think they say meth towards the end. I'm not sure. But, right, all these things mixing well, and, and it's probably the steroids that just push him too far right and, and so it's something to keep in mind of right it steroids he he i probably does not have a doctor for being prescribed steroids and, and it and that's a serious drug people look at steroids like oh it's just a thing that makes you stronger no it's a serious drug right his testosterone is probably 2000 plus right which is more than three times the the normal amount so it, it's important to keep that in mind before oh yeah i'm just gonna hop on steroids it, it's there's real there's real problems that can happen from being on steroids. If he was just on the drugs and, and the other circumstances, he'd probably he'd probably be rough. But I'm not sure if he'd be this rough. If you see what I'm saying. Okay. Has something to do with it, but the, when we're looking for his phone right now, we found some some drugs, so that definitely doesn't help. So yeah, no. There's a there's a whole lot of demons that he's dealing with right now, unfortunately. While securing the suspect's apartment. One officer reveals this is not his first run-in with Chris. Well, yeah, but... Don't me. This guy is... Big, big dude. Yeah, he's... Well, all the way out. Yeah. Um, we're trying. Last time I dealt with him, he was using hero... Oh, I'm sorry, he was using roids and meth. Yeah. Roids and meth, yeah. So, like, that's a bad combination, right? To power through those extra big workouts. <laughs> but well, now we got roids and heroin. So nice. well, probably using so he's got steroids and heroin. Probably in the park. <laughs> Chris was taken to the hospital where he's cleared by medical staff. Let's catch up with officers as they prepare to take the 45 year old. Actually, I don't know what goes on. We're just going to keep going. I'm just trying to get home to my family. I'm cold. I'm out here with no shirt on. And well, Sean Gibson is going to watch me go, go to right? jail when I could go home and be comfortable and be a healthy veteran okay. if I went home and slept with my up. dog. Okay. But you're going to make me go to jail because I was yelling. Tonight. How many days do you give me? Are you going to take my job from me too, Sean Gibson? Give me my shirt. Give me my shirt. Don't touch my... Give me my shirt. Thank you, Sean. Okay. Hey, he's got it out for the Sean guy. Sorry, I shouldn't say that, Sean. 
I'm angry with you because you're making this decision. I, I can tell you're the sergeant. You can be angry at me. But why are you taking me to jail? Oh, because I'm sorry. There's a solution for tonight. No, the solution for tonight is to get help here or have me sleep it off. They've already cleared you out. So we're going to go up there, and then you can work on getting help further from there. All right? There's people up there to help you as well. Dude, shut the f up. Okay. You're a bitch. Yep. Made in Woo. every way. Okay. Every fucking way, Sean. All right. And I see it too. I see it. Okay. Yeah. This is, this is, this is hey. I'm Let's sorry I car. said that. I'm just angry you're taking me to jail. I, I because know, I Chris, just want to eat. I don't man. take any personal yeah. offense. But man. why are you guys taking me to jail when I need help? We're trying to get you that help. My my meds start. are at home. I understand that. But yeah. you're gonna put me in jail yeah. where I gotta fight? You guys want me to fight in jail? No. Yeah, you do, because you haven't been in there. You don't even know what it's like in there. You have no clue. But you think you're hard, dude, with your little freaking goatee. Oh, I don't think I'm hard, <laughs> I know I'm not hard. Me neither. I don't think I am either. I just want to go home. Hey, Chris, what we can do is we can try to... Can you guys just issue me a ticket like you did after you shot me and let me go home? I promise to be calm. Can you have a seat? I, I promise to be calm, guys. All right, I appreciate okay. it. Chris is whisked away to jail, where we join officers who are about to bring him inside. All right, Chris, let's get you out of this bitch, man. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Do you want me to grab your phone for you? I know you're touchy about your stuff. Sure. Got it? Yeah, no, okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll you grab it. I'll grab it from the other side. That way, we're not getting it all. It's in okay. Pissed. It's okay. I don't trust you guys. Okay. Here, I'll get it. Hey, got double I'm cuffs on. That's how big his back is. Look at that bicep vein. You're the man, Chris. No problem. I'll get this. I'm not trying to dress it. I I get it. I know who the guy am. I got it. Is that his phone? Doing something. Don't fing grab me. Okay, okay. Just don't don't f touch off. me, dude. You ain't hard, man. There's real hard motherfuckers out in the streets. Like real ones. Yeah, you ever heard of the, the, the real ones? I'm a fing real one. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> he tried to close the door. Alright, Chris. Come on. We gotta go in this door over here. What's he trying so to put do? Shirt on for me? Do you want it like over your shoulders or how do you want it? It's probably good that they just cooperate with him. Hey Chris, we need you to sit down, buddy, okay? Right here. That's fine if you want to sit right there, but we just need you to sit down, okay? okay. I'm the one one switch. Uh, the VA. They took me to the VA already. I'm sorry if I was being rude at first. I'm not meaning to. I'm just not happy to be here. Um, actually, I'm kind of happy. I can lay down. Can I lay down on this pole? Uh, I just want to get you back. We just got to research all your stuff. All right. Why do you have to do your search? But, but I was on the vet and I was, uh, so why do I, why is there so many officers here? Are you guys scared? What do you do with the mustache? Are you scared at all? Dude, he calls people world? out and they're just like, shoot. I'm scared of rats, dude. That's the only thing. Filthy rats. Hate them. Now that you mention that. I smell them. You know what I mean? Yeah. I don't smell your oh, snakes here. too. Can't forget about snakes. Yeah, snakes. <laughs> Stomp them. Mm -hmm. Especially around snakes. <laughs> yeah. yeah. They bite. Mm -hmm. It's good to talk right, to them because it gets them calm, I think. I'm take your photo real quick, okay? Yeah. I hope he flexes for the photo. <laughs> yeah, that's right here. That's right here, Chris. My right hand, please. Right here. There you go. Hey, what are you doing, bro? 
Why? No, you just grabbed me like trying to push me. He's just trying to escort you, Chris. He's not trying to confront you. I'm trying to be relaxed, but you're trying to walk me. You're pushing. Yeah, you See, are. this is like a new group of guys, I think, so they're not understanding how to work with them, really. Chris, remember when we talked about the faster you get through the process, the quicker you get out of here? This guy that's talking to him, or whose body cam this is, really knows how to handle it with him. So that's what a mugshot looks like. Chris, this will get you through faster. Just open your eyes, okay? Look at the camera. Oh. Yeah, keep them open. Yeah, that was shot. Just stare at it. Mean muggy. <laughs> Dude. Chris was booked for disturbing the peace and resisting arrest. He later pleaded no contest to the charges and was sentenced to 60 days in jail. No. Almost, almost. Just stay right up here for me. 60 days in jail. That sucks. Two, two, Hopefully you got help in that time, though. Look at it. Look at it. Look, 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 look. Hopefully that guy. All right. Well, I was actually kind of sad to watch to be honest hopefully he gets help in these 60 days obviously feel bad for him as he's a veteran but guys go ahead like comment subscribe let me know what you want to see next until next time